so I think part of me was like, I wonder if I gotta be very, very careful how I explain this because people sometimes I explain it a certain way and people really misinterpret what I'm saying and it gets really freaked out. I don't want to say that I was turned on by the True Crime Podcast because I think that's a that's a reductive way to say it. But there was definitely a sexual element. You know, I would hear people describe these things, these violent things. And like I said, on the surface, I'm like, oh my gosh. But then deep down, I'm like, you know, kind of, kind of, I don't know. I, I, yeah, I guess I kind of got turned on, well, turned on by it. I don't know. I mean, it made me a little horny. Is that a crime? No, it's not because it's just in my head, right? So I can, I can be attracted to whatever I want. Um, so. Um, I'm sure you've all had thoughts like this too. And you just kind of go like, all right, you go over there. You know, we're, we're going to put you over here. We're going to put you away and uh, try it. We'll just, you know, if you make any ruckus, then we'll check on you. Um, so I went through the, pro- I was always kind of a witty guy. I was, you know, I had spaghetti arms over here. You know, I was never um, like a jock. I was never good at sports. I was never good at athletic or physical work out much. So I was a little worried about that aspect of it, but but mostly what I thought would be nice is that I thought it would make me more masculine because I'm as I'm sure you can tell I'm not the most masculine guy in the whole world. Um so I thought maybe the military would help me with that. Um and I also thought that um I also thought that it would just make me kind of more in better shape, you know, because I didn't really like my body at the time. Um, and it would just make me, it would hurt me, you know, put some hair on my chest. Um, and obviously when you join the military, you can't straight up be like, hey, so listen, when do we get to actually get some action here? Um, so you just gotta kind of wait and see that. Hershey's chocolate bar. So I was like, oh yeah, I'll go get it. I go in the kitchen. I have a bit. Then ADHD kicks in. I was like, well, why am I holding a piece of chocolate? Oh well. And I fucking eat it. And I go in front of her and she just starts crying and I didn't understand why. <laughs> what the fuck? 